Stevenson with a 77-66 win over Lebanon Valley. Glenn Clark with a pair of 16-point scorers tonight. To my right, Ronald Ayers. To my left, Cameron Sapienza. Uh, Ronald, you've been one of these teams' most consistent shooters all season long. How much do you take it upon yourself? This team was not knocking down shots in the first half. Did you put some sort of pressure on yourself to say, I'm going to have to be the guy to step up and get us going? It was no real pressure, but I just knew my team needed energy. And we came out kind of slow, not really hitting shots. So when I got in, I wanted to you know, help on the offensive end, but also, you know, lock down on the defensive end. Uh, Cam, you've been through a lot. We were just talking about it with Coach. Uh, went through the, the shoulder injury and the surgery and some struggles to start the season. Did did you feel a performance like this coming on for you in recent weeks? Yeah, most definitely, most definitely. I've been struggling, you know, the last few weeks, uh, you know, not scoring as much as I need to, not producing as much as the Coach as coach uh, Stewart needs me to, but – I told him I was like I'm gonna go I'm gonna go out there and hit some shots for him. That's that's what I did. You did exactly that. You hit a lot of shots for him. Um, Ron, take me through. You guys are down by 11 in the first half, right? What what's the conversation like? What was most important in battling back from a mental standpoint, as much as you know, knocking down your shots? Just staying confident and just sticking with what we know. You know, we practice hard every day, so just sticking to our concepts and not letting you know bad calls or them hitting shots affect us. Just sticking to what we know and staying confident. And Cam, I thought, you know, we, we saw you knocking down your shots, but tell me about that drive and the, you faked the three and then you drove in. It seemed like that one was the one that got yeah, the whole bench I, lit up. I had one of those in a while. <laughs> I needed to get back, uh, you know, shooting threes is what I've always done, but I needed to get my confidence going a little bit and get to the hole. So. Uh, well, we're going to have to ask because Coach said you were mad at him. What's the what's the story there? No, nah, no, nah, I'm not mad at him. I'm, I was actually more mad at myself, but I kind of took it out on him. But <laughs> you know, after not playing out Widener, I was I was not happy about you know how I'd been playing, and I just knew I needed to get back in the gym, get more shots up, and hit hit some shots for the team. So maybe stay mad, right? That's <laughs> where we're at. Stay that way, Ronald. Uh, who do we want to shout out? Give me uh give me somebody that you wanna you wanna say hello to, you wanna say thank you for their support, whatever it is. Uh, my family, you know, they've been coming to all the games, whether they're home or away. So all my family watching, all my family coming to the games. I really love y'all support. That's awesome, man. And Cam, what about you? Definitely my family as well. They've been at almost every game, home or away. But also Coach Stewart for you know giving me an opportunity and keep uh, having faith in me. Awesome. I thought your dad was going to jump down onto the floor. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know. He, he wanted that one. He, he was fired up. Ronald, congratulations on a huge game. Cam, same to you. Great win for both you guys. Thanks for taking a couple minutes. Thank you. Thank, uh, you. Thank you. I'm Glenn Clark. This is GoMustangSports.com.